Hi, Donald here with Floating Feathers Kayak Fly Fishing School. Today I'm going to show you two different ways to get into a kayak or launch a kayak from a shore, like a, a, a sandy shore, um, a slightly rocky shore, um, something that has a nice gradual um, uh, incline or decline into the water. So the first one I'm going to show you um, is going to be with the kayak perpendicular to the shore. And the second way I'm going to show you is with the kayak parallel to the shore. So the first one, uh, option one if you will, um, is we're going to get this thing perpendicular. Now you can put it bow to the shore or stern to the shore and I'm going to show you how both ways are at. So I'm going to start with the stern on the shore. So we're just going to pick the front of the kayak up. You're going to have to get your feet wet just a little bit, about six to eight inches of water, maybe a foot depending on your kayak. You want it so the kayak just slightly moves so it's floating. Okay, you can go back just a little bit. All right, so you just want a little bit of that kayak sitting on shore so that it, it stays still. All right, you're going to get in. Make sure you have your PFD on, of course. All right, so you grab this. All right, PFD check. Okay, so where way you're going to get in this kayak when it's perpendicular to shore, and I've got the bow out now, is you're going to kind of sit with your legs against the kayak. Let the kayak hit your, hit your uh, calves, and you're just going to sit down in the seat. So I like to put one hand on the seat one hand on the side. You almost halfway sit down. Then you're just going to sit down in the seat nice and easy. Right? You see how the kayak kind of rolls to me? Right? Rolls to the edge I'm sitting on because that's where the weight is. All right? Now you're going to keep your left foot planted. All right? You're going to turn your body to the right and you're going to put your right foot in and then you're going to put your left foot in. And that is it. That is all there is to getting in a kayak. So to push off, you're going to take your paddle and you're going to scoot. You kind of scoot your butt and push at the same time. And there it is. That is how you launch a fishing kayak from shore. Okay? So we're gonna pull up here and we're gonna we're gonna exit the kayak. So we're gonna come in, bow first. Now you can use your paddle to keep your um, balance if you need to, but I'm just gonna put it right here for right now. Getting out, very similar to the way of getting in. You're gonna put you're gonna slightly turn your body um, to whatever side you're comfortable with, I go out the left. So um, I put my left foot down. Notice my hands are still on the chair. Top of the back of the chair and the bottom of the right hand chair. Okay. I turn 90 degrees. Okay. Then I still keep my left hand on the back of the seat. I put my right hand on the side of the kayak. And as you lean towards the stand, it's going to tilt, but it's not going to go anywhere. Okay. So you're just going to use this to prop yourself up. All right. And there you are out of the kayak. Okay. So. That is option one with the stern, or excuse me, with the bow um, out. I'm going to show you how to launch it with the bow in. So, same thing. You're going to back it up just a little bit so it moves. See how it rocks just a little bit. You're going to get in, right? Hands on the kayak. Gently sit down in the seat. Swing one leg over. Swing the other leg over. Now you're going to push yourself backwards, right? Scoot, scoot, and push with the paddle. Same thing. Okay. Very simple, very easy way to get into a fishing kayak. So now we're going to get out the exact same way. Okay, turn one foot down, one foot down, move your opposite hand, use the kayak, stand yourself up, you're out of the kayak. Okay, so that is how to get in and out of the kayak, in and out of a fishing kayak when on a nice sandy shore or a slight incline um, with the kayak perpendicular to shore. So now I'm going to show you how to get into the kayak when it's parallel to the shore. Um, and this is a little bit different. Um, it's a little bit different. So now if you can see the kayak will still rock just a little bit, but you've got, you don't have to get in as, wa get in as deep of water. So you'll need about four inches of water, right? Just enough. So the one end, one end of the kayak, so the kayak closest to shore, catches when you push on it okay and the reason you want to catch is because you're going to stand in this and then sit down okay so when you're getting in a kayak that is parallel to the shore okay you're going to take your paddle all right you can use this for balance okay you're going to use this for balance you're going to get your right foot in just like this that kayak or rock just a little bit all right your left foot's in okay now you can find your hand sit down then extend your feet then use your paddle and scoot and push, scoot and push, scoot and push, and there you go. Okay, so that is how you launch it 
when you are parallel to the shore. And now we're going to launch it, or excuse me, now we're going to land it parallel to shore. So you're going to come up, you're going to turn the kayak just a little bit with the paddle, all right? Use your draw stroke as much as you can to get this kayak where you need it. And then you're going to get out. Sorry, let me scoot back up here where the camera is. You're going to get out pretty much the same way you got in, right? You're going to swing your feet over, right? Let me get back to the shore, right? Stand up. Same way we got in and out, out of the other way. Um, and that keeps your kayak uh, a little closer to shore if you like to do it that way. I like to do it that way if there's a lot of wind or if there's a lot of current in the water um, because that kayak will stay a little positioned better. Um, most of the time you're going to find me launching a kayak, it's going to be when it's uh, perpendicular to the shore or a kind of a combination of two. I'm about at a 45, okay? So at a 45, you only need about four inches, maybe six inches of water. You're gonna get it the same way we would if it was parallel to shore, excuse me, perpendicular to shore. So you're gonna sit, paddle away. All right, scoot, paddle, scoot, paddle. And then you're about, you can paddle wherever you want to. Oh wow, there are some redfish tailing out here, which is kind of nice. <laughs> Not sure if you can see that on the camera or not, but I'm about to get me some flies out here and see if I can't catch me a redfish. But um, that is how you launch, enter, and exit a fishing kayak in two different ways. Again, I'm Donald. Thank you all for watching. Please subscribe below.